What's up, YouTube? It's Two House, and welcome back to Summer Lamb. Now, uh, I'm digging all in my nose on camera. Oh, oh, the phone's for me. You know what? Things no. aren't actually looking too bad for you so far. I remember I'm this. almost tempted to say this you might not nice end one. up scoring too low. Almost. I handle all the bad people, remember? Okay. So, what have we learned? A police so officer, we, oh. a single father. What happened to, uh, what's her name? Anna? I wonder. Well, it's not really in my jurisdiction to know about that. We're here to focus on you, my friend, and... We're not friends. As much as I hate to say it, there hasn't really been anything I could justify docking your points for yet. Plus, you do really seem to care about that kid. I think I need to learn a little bit more about you. Who you really are. Where your mind's at. Step into the next room. I, I want to test something. Alright. So he gonna test something. He wants to know why I love the kid. Cause this my ooh. Okay. They change up just a little bit. All right, the door shut automatically. That's nice. All right, we got Frederick. I mean, we got um George Washington right there. And you see, I don't think I know enough about you yet. I want to learn who you are. Get inside okay. of your head. So here's okay. your job. There are two philosophers who have interesting theories about morality and ethics. They're okay. the two guys you're looking at now, Emmanuel Kant and Jeremy Bentham. They each came up with their own idea of what a good action is. Kant proposed the idea of deontological ethics. By his model, all actions are inherently good or bad, regardless of their consequences. Now let's use the trolley dilemma as an example. A trolley is going to run over five people who are tied to the tracks. If you change the direction of the trolley, it would only hit one person. Kant would argue that you don't change the trolley's direction. Sure, five people will die, but you didn't have any direct input on it. If you change the trolley's direction, that one death was caused by you. You committed an immoral action regardless of the outcome. Okay, I guess that Jeremy makes sense. Jeremy Bentham, on the other hand, would disagree. Bentham proposed the idea of utilitarianism. By his ideology, the right or moral decision is the one that results in the most good. The outcome is more important than the action itself. He would say that you steer the trolley to hit the one man. Sure, you were directly involved in his death, but more people survive than would have otherwise. All you need to do is tell me who you agree with. Kant's deontological method oh, or Bentham's method I, of utilitarianism. I don't know. Where do your morals lie? Personally, I'm just curious who tied everyone to the tracks. There are much more efficient ways to kill people if that was your goal. Anyways, push the button in front of the portrait of who you agree with most. After that, head out into the hallway. Your next trial will be waiting for you. I, why did they do this to me? He looked like George Washington, and this bitch looked like Benjamin Franklin. Okay. Okay. Now, can I remember this? Um, He tied the people okay he didn't okay somebody tied the people to the trap and he say i forgot what the bit say i ain't even gonna lie okay he say more people survive than died he say more people survive but you kill one person uh benjamin franklin or him. More people survived than died. Let's go with Benjamin Franklin because he on a hundred dollar bill. Dollar dollar bill, y'all. Did I do that? What? That's it. I just pressed the button and leave. Okay. Have a good day. Bye, guys. I think I fucked that one up. I think I did. Whatever. It's it's fine. It's fine. Okay, let's go to door number three. Oh, oh. Okay. All right. Time to get some work done. Time to get some work done, check buddy. See if I have any reports to take care of today. Hey, y'all. D. That's that's weird. The, okay, this Captain must be Mount. Typically office. likes to keep to herself. Does not bother her. Oh, okay. Okay, that's somebody else's office. My my mistake. Hmm. It doesn't look like I'm assigned to anything at the moment. I should go down to evidence and check on that forest case. Okay, the narrator sound like the guy from um Case Animatronics. 
the the man on it case that that's what this bitch sounds like. I knew he would sound familiar. Probably the same actor. Sorry, at acting. They need some classes. Hey, what are you doing here? Who let you in? Oh, uh, hi, Matt. I was just checking back on. It is Evelyn. On the forest case. You know you're not supposed to be here, right? She's stealing. Plus, how'd you get in without a key? Yeah, how oh, you did that? I'm sorry. I just told security I was working with you, and they let me in. Oh, really? Wasn't a ton of fuss about it. Yeah, security has fallen behind a bit. It's these damn paycheck cuts. It's okay. You can hang out in here if you want. I was actually here for the same reason. Oh, well, I laid out the photos back in the corner. I assume that's your desk? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Why well, might... Check it out. And, hey, don't mess with anything else in here, okay? Wouldn't dream of it. Yeah, you stealing. You you got in here because you stole the key from the security guard. You show him some some you show him some treats, and he lets you in. Y'all think y'all slick? I know everything. Yeah, I still think my theory stands. Gunman was the one dead in the cave. He died from a stab wound inflicted okay. by our initial victim. All right. Well, just a drug deal gone bad. A drug deal gone bad. Don't. They got themselves in that position. Oh, how could you be so heartless? Good. You can't let that stuff get to you. I'm gonna head upstairs. You should probably get out of here before somebody says something. Okay, yeah. I'll be out in just a bit. I don't trust Evelyn. She seems like she's starting some stuff. I'm watching you, even though I can barely see you. I'm still watching you. She probably will turn out to be my phone oh. ringing. Oh, shit. Not now. I wasn't supposed to call me yet. I need to take it somewhere me? private. Take what? 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 Where you gonna take it to? T take it in here. No. Oh shit! Somebody calling me. Ooh, that music said down. Ooh, that's scary. I don't like that down. Out to the phone. The elevator is private enough. All right, let's go to the, the yeah. Let's go here. You can answer it in here. No, okay, that's fine. Okay, the bathroom. The bathroom is very private. Excuse me, y'all. I gotta go poo poo. Move, move. There ain't no door on the bathroom. What kind of bathroom this is? Oh, 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 oh. Charlie, I told you not to call me at work. I gave you my schedule. Oh, and you think you have the authority to tell me when to call? I don't give a shit where you Ooh. are. If I call you. You pick up the goddamn phone. Oh. What do you need? See, that's more like it. What I need is what we discussed. You still need the money, right? Yeah, I just... I don't like it. Well, tough shit. Think about it like this. After a few jobs, we cut our ties, and you leave with just enough cash to make all your problems just go away. Listen here. I know all about the government job pay cuts, and I know without this money, you'll... Where is it? William and Son's Bar. My boys will have been in and out. Be in the case. And hey, remember, you're doing this for the kid. <sighs> okay, um. William and Sons. Okay. I need to get back to work. This never happened. This shit happened. That bitch cussed you out. Okay, so we're done with room three. That was a little, um. What the fuck does he want? Now, this is what I was expecting. Okay. You're a bit sketchier than you let on. This will be entertaining. Taking suspicious jobs, working for the seedy underbelly of your society. You're just a basic crooked cop. Mm. You know, I hate to say it, but I was almost rooting for you. I thought you may be the one good person I had. Oh, well. Also, Bentham was an interesting choice. I mean, that's what most people would say, but in practice... Anyways, you've got more trials, and I've got more life to judge. Let's get a move on. This man is the devil. This is the devil talking to me. I just got cussed out on the phone. But I don't know who that was. That bitch cussed me out. Alright, we're at the bar. So, what's the hey, what's up, Elmer? Armed robbery. According to the Ooh. statement from the bartender, oh, three robbery. men in masks came in and ransacked the place. Took everything they could. Cash register was completely emptied. So was the safe. Do you have anything to go off of? Well, the barman said he shot one of the men in the leg, but no one was killed. They all got away. 
That's not much. Hey, did you bring that UV light with you? Oh, yeah, I got it right here. Good thinking. Y yeah, I got hey, it. I, I was thinking maybe I could help you. No, no, you better just no. stay back. No, I you can't help get me. Get all this sorted out. Oh. I got it. I got it. Okay. I got it, Evelyn. Yeah. I'll just uh, be right there. You just here. chill out. Yeah, you just you stand right there. I don't all trust right. you anyway. Let's get this over with. Let's get this over with. Handgun. PM40 model. This must have been the bartenders. I don't think I need to bother with it. Okay, let's not bother with that. One of you varmers in here shot somebody. And I'm going to find you. If my name ain't... I don't know. I don't know his name. This must All be right, some blood. Got shot. Shit, I'm going to need to get this cleaned up. Okay, we got some blood splats. Uh oh, we got some money right here. I'm about to pick this shit up and go to. Looks like your guys dropped something, Charlie. You really need to get some better goons. Shoot. That boy's dropped 300, so I'll go take that. I found a key. Can I take it? All right, we got a key. All right. Okay, so they just took all the money out of the safe and, and, and dropped $300, which was stupid. Why would you do that? No sign of him breaking in. Charlie must have gotten him a code somehow. Okay, so he gave him the code. Oh, oh, three more hundred dollars? That bitch got six hundred dollars on him. All right, so. Yep, emptied out. Okay, Charlie they took all the money out of the cash around. register. They said nine clues. Ain't no way you're going to find nine clues in here. <gasps> the restrooms. What is this? No. No. Okay. Whoa, he about to have a panic attack. Hey, shit. take your shit. Oh, that okay. bitch about to die. Okay. I'll be okay. Yeah, take your pip pip. Okay. Oh, there. Oh, shoot. I was about to pass. Move out. Okay. I need to get back to work. Hey, man, you oh, can't be no... These guys have oh. at least made an attempt Wim to be clean. Take all the money. Bartender's arm safe. Okay, the cold safe is dead. We have got to see but don't get sloppy. So that means don't kill nobody and have blood leaking, which they failed. I'm gonna need more than just a towel for this. What? The, what do you need? You clean up blood. You need a towel and some water. Get some water. Some soap? No, no soap. Flow cleaner. A bucket. A bucket. No. Okay. You need yeah, the. I can use okay. That. Okay. Okay. So he did need that shit. All right. So we clean the blood up. Let me go talk to Evelyn. Maybe she got something to say. She be tripping over there. Hey, you all right, how Elf? Are you doing? Okay. I still think I could help out if you no, need. No, it's all right. I no, think I'd better no. just handle this. It's one. all right, Evelyn. You chill right. out. Well, I'll let you get back to it. All right. You just chill out. You have yourself a nice time over there. She just standing there, just chilling. Just chilling, Evelyn. Good job, Evelyn. Just chilling your little soul out. While well, I'm over here cleaning up blood stain. Ain't nothing like a little blood stain clean up. Okay. Um, I s oh, the UVA light. I forgot about it. I forgot about the light. Use the light. Handprints. All right. All right. Okay. So that's what I was missing. The UVA light in the office. Yeah, look in, no, look on the, uh, the, 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 the table. Look on the, the, the table. Nothing. Look on this table. Yep, another handprint. My, bruh. My boy. All right. Okay, so the rest of them should be back in this office. Definitely. I'm smart. I'm smart sometimes. Cold. 
Bruh, look. Oh my clean gosh. A whistle. All right, clean as a whistle. Sweetie. Okay, I was about to say something, but it didn't, it didn't go with that. Damn it. Okay. The handprints back there. Okay, so I know it's handprints up here. Ugh, Charlie, next time have your guys wear gloves or something. Okay, right. All right, so we got one more, and it should be out here. My mouse is stuck, and I can't pull it no more. And bam, got it. All right, I think that's everything. I should talk to her. Evelyn, Evelyn. Hey, Evelyn, how are you? I miss Evelyn so much. How you doing, Evelyn? You like you doing? All right, good. I think we're done here. Did you find anything worthwhile? Uh, no, actually. What? How is that even possible? Uh, I don't know. I just, I couldn't find anything. That, that can't be right. He's lying. Let me take a look. No, it's fine. I uh, Evelyn, Evelyn, no, it's I fine. Came, there was. Don't nothing. worry yourself. Okay. Don't worry yourself, Evelyn. Yeah. Well, let's get back. But everything's to the fine. I'll take you home let's before we head back to the precinct. Come on, Will. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Everything's fine, Evelyn. Everything's fine. That man is crooked as hell. Okay. That's fucked up. No one's here. No, okay. Good. So, I'm thinking we're here to destroy the files. That's what he's doing. He about to destroy the evidence. Okay, here we go. Uh, you about to throw the money in the trash? That bitch must be lost in the mouth. I'll throw it this time. Bitch, them hundreds you about to throw in there. This bitch is stupid. And you gonna burn? You gonna burn it? Oh, he got me all types. Mm -mm -mm. Look. Hurts my soul. Say anything, anything that go his way, he deserve it. Now I gotta answer the phone and talk to Satan again. All right, I, what's up? And that, my friend, is why you're in here with me. I know, I know. Cleaning up evidence from a crime scene, I expected more. From I know, you. I'm sorry. I mean, not really, but still, all for what? Some money? That's a little thing I like to call greed, and it does not look good on I you. I know, I'm sorry. You know, I think there's a little more I'd like to learn about you. Head into the next room. I want to test something. Okay. I'm sorry, okay? He, he doesn't believe me. Oh! Hey, we back in here. This is what I like to see. A little test. A little popcorn. Oh, 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 oh. Let me start with an example. All right, let's go. Say you're in a room with a button. Right. And you know that something will happen when you press that button. Correct. You don't know exactly what, but something will happen. Correct. It could be something terrific. Something that could save lives could also be catastrophic killing orphans and puppies killing the whole nine orphans yards. and puppies but that's you have absolutely no way of knowing what you do know is that you have agency over whether or not you press that button pressing it is entirely your choice press that it that said if you did press the button should you be held accountable for the consequences of these actions even if you didn't know what they would be no should someone be held accountable for something in which they have agency but no knowledge on the possible outcome Answer by pressing the button of which you agree most strongly with. Once you're finished, exit back out into the hallway. Your next trial is waiting. What is this, like, uh, what is this adding up to? Hell accountable? Hell no. Not hell accountable. I don't know. You should be held accountable. Bob. All right, let's go. If this man do not walk right, this bitch act like he drunk. All right, next room. Oh, no. Am I dead? This bitch went to heaven. Excuse me. Oh, my God, this is a glitch. This is like heaven. I thought he died. He took his medicine today. Okay, I said hell accountable. Bam. Back to the hallway. He bet not. He bet not fall into the ground again. I swear to God. 
Oh, okay. That what I thought. What kind of glitch was that? All right, we're back into the house. Honey, I'm home. Oh, no, she's not here. I forgot. Hey, yeah. Oh, what's up? Oh, there's a toy. A little cheer. Oh, hey, little buddy. Well, I didn't see I you know. sitting there. Let me get you something to eat. Oh, yeah. Darn it. Where'd I put the baby food? I got to find that baby food. Can you give him a piece of toast? A piece of bread or something? No, none of these cabinets is available. All right, little baby, don't start that crying. I'm about to find your food right now. Oh, is that some whiskers? Can get some of that whiskers. No, I already whiskers. got it out of there. I set it down somewhere. You don't remember where you set the baby food to? Oh, he about to start crying. I'm about to come. I'm Oh my god. I'm coming with your food. Give me just a second. This bitch set the food in the basement. Why is the food in the basement? Okay, so which one is this baby food? N none of these is baby food. Give him some. Damn, this shit got blurred. This bitch blind. No offense. This food ain't down here. The walking mechanics suck in this game. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, that food ain't down here. I don't know where my boy set the baby food to, but he might want to get that because that's kind of important. I found it. There you are. And bye, y'all. Let's get this to Joseph. Come on. Here you go, <laughs> there Joseph. There you go, buddy. Eat up. There you go. Are we getting tired? Come on. Is that sound of him eating? Was that Let's eating? Put you down for a nap. I'm never going to let okay. anything happen to you, buddy. Okay, I got the clear baby in my hand. I'm gonna make sure I'm okay, so I can take care of you. Where you gonna? Don't get that money. Why sure. is this baby clear? Yeah, this ain't weird at all. I guess I lay him down in the courage and uh and rock a bad baby, I guess. Can I run with the baby in my hand? I'm pretty sure that's illegal. Or frowned upon. Stay One of the tight, two. Buddy. All right. Okay. I need to get That's the baby. Done. I'll check on the mail, maybe my email too. Water has been That baby sleep with his hands in the area. That out in the basement. I'm gonna say. All right, so I need to go to the basement where I just literally came from. Who is playing the guitar right now? That's what I'm trying to figure out. So where he wanted to get the work done at? He said go down to the basement. He gotta wash some clothes. No. Ah, Turn on hot water like heater. A bolt came loose. I need something to tighten it. Should have a wrench around here oh, somewhere. Oh, here you go. This will help. You can tighten it with tank. this wrench. With the hidden valor wrench. There. That should fix things. Yeah. Now we're good to go. So does he want to like take a shower first? Cause that look like a hot water heater. Let me see if he want to take a shower. Yeah, that's that. Yep, I think so. And no, no shower. No. Okay. So he I, he want to get some work done. I missed everything that guy said. All right, Wait, come on. They're gonna start laying off officers. Ooh. I can't lose this job. Well, it does look like you're about to lose it today, buddy. Left click. That is not good at all. You need to be laid out because you're crooked. You're a crooked cop. You're helping people. Destroying evidence. That's illegal. Where do I... Hold on. Where do I go? <clears throat> Go, son. What the? Just doing? Closet. 
I don't need anything in there at the moment. So where does he want to go to work on the stuff at? Right here? More bills. All right, here we go. I can't oh, pay for okay. all of these. I'm going to need to prioritize. You can't pay for all? Well, well, you might want to prioritize. I think it's fine. Should I go back? I... Uh oh, the phone rang. That's that man. He called to cuss me out again. Why? Jesus. At least pretend to be happy to hear from me. What do you need me to do? <sighs> you really aren't any fun, are you? Charlie, just tell me what the hell you need me to do. Hey, 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 relax, man. Keep cool. I got another job for you. And then I get my money? And then you'll get your money. <sighs> What's the job? You know the laundromat on 8th? Yeah, what about it? No, don't tell That's me. That's my laundromat. And I have a bit of evidence there. You're fronting using a laundromat? How cliche can Hey! I... I didn't ask for you to tell me how to run my goddamn business! That bit I... scared me. I'm sorry. What do you need? We're moving our operations elsewhere. Go to the laundromat tomorrow night and clean up the, uh, <clears throat> back room. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll take care of it. I'll give you more info later. One last job, then I get the money. Finish this, and you'll have enough to take care of everything you need. Good. I'll be there. Okay. So we're doing dirty work for a guy that is doing crimes. Just to get some money? I mean, I guess. Feels like... Oh, he's calling back. You, uh, Hello. You really cared about that boy, huh? I mean, not to discredit this whole process. I'm sure you're still a terrible person. Just... You seem like a good dad all I don't know it's odd I typically only see the bad when I'm judging people I don't understand why I'm seeing all this but again you're still a terrible person things really are more black and white than you'd think anyway what's the deal with you and this Charlie guy he seems a bit sketchy you know he's why dead you're here? Dirty Did you cross him just one wrong move and then <laughs> no no that'd be too easy no, whatever head on outside your next trial is waiting for you. All right. Thank you for for that. How many more doors we got? We got three more doors and then the final door. But guess what? We'll see you at another episode of Summerlands, guys. Thank y'all for tuning in at YouTube. Summerlands.